Hello everyone, this is Mamta Mund and today we are going to solve chapter 1. Chapter name is Knowing Our Number, Self-Practice Exercise Questions 1E, Questions 1 to 6 of Self-Practice 1E. Chapter 1, chapter name is Knowing Our Numbers of Class 6 of New Learning Composite Mathematics Textbook. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. And please visit my blog maxgrade.com for more information regarding the textbook solutions of CBAC, ICC and other states board. And if you like this video then please click the like button. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve self-practice exercise questions 1 to 6, self-practice 1e and uh, chapter name is knowing our numbers and topic is estimation of numbers and rounding of numbers let's solve some questions now question number two round up to the nearest hundred first bit a 624 we have to round up this number 624 to the nearest hundred when we round up the number to the nearest 100, first look at the tens place digit. Here tens place digit is 2, which is less than 5. So just try down the 100 place digit as it is, that is 6. Don't add 1 with the 100 place digit. Just write down 6 as it is, 100 place digit and just write down 0 in tens place digit and write down 0 in unit place digit. So, 624 rounded up to the nearest 100 will be 600. Now, question number second bit B, 136. We have to round up this number 136 to the nearest 100. When we round up a number to the nearest 100, first look at the tens place digit. Here tens place digit is 3, which is less than 5. So, just write down tens place digit as it is that is 1 in 100 place digit as it is 1 and just write down 3 changes to 0 write down 0 in tens place digit and write down 0 in unit place digit that is 6 changes to 0 and this tens place digit 3 changes to 0 so 136 rounded off to the nearest 100 will be 100 So 136 rounded up to the nearest nearest 100 is 100. Now third bit C 2095. We have to round up this number 2095 to the nearest 100. When we round up a number to the nearest 100, first look at the tens place digit. Here tens place digit is 9, which is more than 5. So just add 1 to the 100 place digit. That is 0 changes to 0 plus 1. That is 1. And this uh, uh, ten, this 1000 plus digit as it is. That is 2. Write down 2 in 1000 plus digit. is 2 only. And this 0 changes to 1. And write down 0 in 10 in tens plus digit. That is 9 changes to 0. And this unit plus digit. Write down 0 in unit plus digit. That is 5. Unit plus digit 5 changes to 0. So, 2095 rounded up to the nearest 100 will be 2000. This 1000 plus digit as it is 2 and this 0 changes to 1, 0 plus 1 and this 9 changes to 0. Tens plus digit, write down tens plus digit 0 and unit plus digit 0. So, 2100. So, 2095 rounded up to the nearest 100 is 2100. Now D bit 4053. We have to round up this number 4053 to the nearest 100. When we round up the number, any number to the nearest 100, just look at the tens place digit. Here tens place digit is 5, which is equal to 5. So just add 1 to the 100 plus digit. That is 0 changes to 0 plus 1. That is 1. And write down 0 in tens place digit that is 5 changes to 0 and this unit place digit changes to 0 that is 3 changes to 0 and just write down 
thousand plus digit as it is that is four just write down four only so four thousand fifty three rounded off to the nearest hundred will be just in thousand plus digit four and this zero changes to one zero plus one is one and this five changes to zero three changes to zero so four thousand one hundred so four thousand fifty three rounded off to the nearest hundred will be four thousand one hundred Now EB five thousand nine hundred seventy four, five thousand nine hundred seventy four rounded up to the nearest hundred. We have to round up this number five thousand nine hundred seventy four to the nearest hundred. When you round up a number to the nearest hundred, just look at the tens plus digit. So tens plus digit is seven, which is more than five. So just add one to the hundred plus digit. That is nine. Here hundred plus digit is nine. Nine changes to nine plus one, which is ten. One is carry over. Just add one with the thousand plus digit. That is five. This thousand plus digit five add with carry over one. That is five plus one is six. And just write down zero. This zero. And write down tens plus digit and unit plus digit in tens plus digit zero and unit plus digit zero. So five thousand nine hundred seventy four rounded up to the nearest hundred will be this thousand plus five changes to five plus one six this six and this nine this zero tens plus digit and carry over one add with this thousand plus digit five five plus one is six and this zero zero and seven changes to zero. Tens place digit write down tens place digit zero and unit place digit zero, so six thousand, so five thousand nine hundred seventy four rounded off to the nearest hundred will be six thousand. Now F B twenty thousand eight hundred nine round off this number twenty thousand eight hundred nine to the nearest hundred. When you round off any number to the nearest hundred, first look at the tens place digit. The tens place digit is zero. And zero is less than five. Just write down eight as it is. That is hundred plus digit eight, and this thousand plus digit zero. Just write down zero and ten thousand plus digit as it is. That is two. And this eight. Write down eight. And ten plus digit zero. Write down zero in tens place and unit place digit zero. So twenty thousand eight hundred nine rounded up to the nearest hundred will be twenty thousand eight hundred. Now G B eighteen thousand nine hundred ninety four round up this number eighteen thousand nine hundred ninety four to the nearest hundred. When you round up any number to the nearest hundred. Just write. Uh, just look at the tens place digit. Here, tens place digit is nine, which is more than five. So just add one to the hundred place digit. That is nine. This hundred place digit is nine. Nine changes to nine plus one. Nine plus one is ten. In ten, one is carry over. So just one add one. This carry over one with the thousand place digit. That is eight. This eight changes to eight plus one. That is nine. And write down ten thousand plus digit as it is. That is one as it is. And this eight changes to nine. And this nine. In nine, this write down this zero, zero. And this ten uh, tens place digit write down tens place digit zero and unit place digit zero. So eighteen thousand nine hundred ninety four rounded up to the nearest hundred will be nineteen thousand. Now H B seventy nine thousand nine hundred ninety two round up this number seventy nine thousand nine hundred ninety two to the nearest hundred. When you round up a number to the nearest hundred, just look at the tens place digit. Here tens place digit is nine, so just uh, and nine is greater than five. Nine is more than five, so so just add one to the hundred place digit. Here hundred place digit is nine. Nine changes to nine plus one. Nine plus one is ten. 
and 10 in one, one is carryable. So just add 1 to the 1000 plus digit. Here 1000 plus digit is 9. So 9 changes to 9 plus 1. 9 plus 1 is 10. Here in 10, 1 is carryable. So just add 1, carryover 1 with the 10,000 plus digit. That is 7. 10,000 plus digit 7 changes to 7 plus 1. 7 plus 1 is 8. So 7 changes to 8 and 9, this 0, 8 and this 0 and this 0 and this 10th place digit write down 9 changes to 0. 10th place digit is 0 and write down 0 in unit place digit that is 2 changes to 0. So 80,000. So 79,992 rounded up to the nearest 100 is 80,000. Now I beat 69,925 round up to this number to the nearest 100. When we round up a number to the nearest 100, just look at the tens place digit. Here tens place digit is 2, which is less than 5. So just write down 9 in 100 plus digit as it is, that is 9. Just write down 9 as it is. And this 1000 plus digit, write down 1000 plus digit as it is 9. And this 10,000 plus digit as it is, that is 6. And this 9, we'll just write down 9. And this 2, tens plus digit, in tens plus digit, write down 0. And unit plus digit, write down 0. So, this 2 changes to 0 and 5 changes to 0. So, 69,900. So, 69,925 rounded up to the nearest 100 will be 69,900. If you have not subscribed my YouTube channel, then please subscribe my YouTube channel. And if you have any doubt, then please write in comment section and I will reply. Keep learning, keep watching and please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you. Thank you.